guys, this is your girl Tammy here and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to share with you a haul that I am doing today. It is just a home decor haul, things that I have received or purchased and I'm excited to share them with you. Okay, the first item that I'm going to share with you is some candles by Simon Design and I absolutely love these candles these are the small ones and these were $14.99 this is what they look like the casing is so freaking gorgeous isn't that gorgeous and look at the rib cut on the on the camera holders so these are the smaller ones I'll pull one out and show it to you gorgeous isn't that gorgeous? Simply gorgeous. So um, I have two sets in $24.99. And it's so gorgeous as well. They're identical, except a little bit larger. Larger one. Here is the smaller one. Isn't that gorgeous? I simply love Crystal. And when before I got married, I used to have a bunch and I used it in my wedding and for some reason they didn't return from my wedding and so this is probably my first time ever replacing some of the pieces that went missing this ice pail gorgeous do you see the detail on this ice pail this is the way it opens up and you can see my fingerprints all over it and it opens up it's very thick so it's hollow in the inside in between so it won't give a lot of sweat on the outside of the container which is nice so you can actually sit it on your wooden cabinet i don't have a bar cart but i am using my buffet as a bar station and i'll be sharing that with you soon but isn't this gorgeous and you guys, I paid $9 for this. I actually gave them fuss because one of the screws were slightly loose. And so it didn't take much to just, I used a butter knife to screw it right back in. And so they gave me 10% off, which the original price was $12.99. And this product is by Max Studio. I also got the shaker cup. And the shaker cup is very, very pretty. Now you pull this part out to like pour the drink out once you mix your um, martinis or whatever. And then, um, and this side is to pour the alcohol in. So I really like that. This will be my fourth shaker cup. But I really wanted this for the gold pattern in it. I really, really love that. And I kind of think it'll look good in my kitchen and it'll also incorporate some silver metal because everything is like gold and white in here so and this was only seven dollars and 99 cent the last one of the set is this beautiful champagne pail or wine pail so you can just stick your bottles of wine in here or well, probably two or maybe just one um, depending on how large the, the bottles are and max studio I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. You can put some ice in it, wrap your bottles with some um, napkin, um, table napkins, and just absolutely gorgeous. This piece was sixteen. I'm sorry, sixteen ninety nine from Home Goods. So far, everything that I've shown you is from Home Goods. So gorgeous pieces. I just absolutely love it. I got this from Burlington and it is it is like an ice tray that you can put like for instance if you're doing crabs lobsters um veggies um avocados things that might turn colors if it gets room temperature or things that might spoil room temperature so it comes with a little cup inside and a huge lid it's actually a huge item so this is what it looks like inside. You have this tray here. 
Let me see if I can do this without having to. Okay, so this tray comes out. You see this tray? Okay, so this tray sits in. And it doesn't sit flush to the bottom. So you put your ice on the top here. And you put your food on top of the ice. And as it melts, the water goes to the bottom of the container. And you have your dip right in the center. This, this flush goes right in the center. And then you put your lid on it. And so it's clear, it's acrylic, it's very pretty. And this piece is from Burlington Coat Factory and it was $16.99. But I didn't stop with this one. I got one for you guys. And this is how it comes um, packaged inside out. And so as you can see, I have not opened it. Although it was tempting, but they look identical. So this would be for one of you lucky winners. Like I said, it will be two. So this would be for one of you lucky winners. This would be one of the items that I use in my giveaway this month, at the end of the month. Um, and it's gonna accumulate. So I'm gonna be giving away several items, things that you can use for your home, things that all have everything to do with styling your home or designing your home or being creative in your home so everything that you get from me will be pertaining to that it won't be anything that's outside of what my channel is about so the next item guys is something you've seen a lot everybody has this pillow right so it's been hauled and i was like mm, i'm not gonna uh -uh, i don't see it oh, but huh. Look at this pillow. Now this pillow is heavy, thick, like, I mean super thick ribbon. And it's really shiny ribbon. This is so heavy and thick. Um, and this is a cream color. It's gonna match my couch very well. It's very soft, very adjustable. And me, you know me, I am a pillow person and I have a firm belief in never buy a pillow that you cannot remove the cushion out of because I like to go in and change the cushion to feathers. I love my pillows to be feathered, but this seems pretty um, flexible and adjustable so I might not change it for quite a while. I think it's down cushioning inside and um, so here is the zipper. This is how you remove cushion to change it out or just to simply wash your pillow it's definitely um it's definitely a down cushion inside very soft very full um cushion inside of here and the back is pretty coarse and it feels like the same fabric from the painter's drop cloth and that's that's always a plus because I'm obsessed with painters drop cloths too. So this definitely is going in my living room. It's the exact same color of my couch, a nice creamy, creamy color, not white, not ivory, just creamy, um, pretty creamy. So I got this pillow. I only could find one. I tried to get three, but since I couldn't find, I mean, really, really, I'm glad I only got one because one is just good enough. Okay, so I got two of these. The first pillow was $19.99. These two pillows are worth, I think, $19.99 or $24.99. I'm not sure. I've already popped the tags off of them, so I apologize. But I'm most definitely $19.99. I'm pretty sure of it. So I thought this would be pretty. It's also a cream color. It also has the painter's drop cloth, like thick fabric and color on the back and it also has the zipper this pillow is made by Cynthia Rowley can you see this pillow can you see the shimmer do you see the shimmers so this pillow has several fibers in it. Okay, several different texture, 
So it has three textures. Um, the first texture is like this braided piece here. And then it has the tassel, the strings. And then it has um, streamage, like what you would put on a Christmas tree. And I thought that was very unique. So I got two of these bad boys. So I thought this would be great to change out the furry pillow pillows that I had on my couch because the furry pillows, the furry pillows was starting to make me feel like, you know, too Hollywood glam. Like I love, I love glam. I love Hollywood glam. I love it all. Trust me, I do traditional everything. And at some point, I thought I was more traditional. My style was more traditional. But as I was looking around my home, I realized that I'm more like leaning towards Hollywood glam. And I was like, wow, you know, I really didn't, it kind of snuck up on me. So I'm accepting it, but um, I'm definitely trying to tone it down a little bit. So I thought if I remove some of the furry pillows, that um that was like just fur like faux fur like you thought it was a fox that was a white fox or something or a white polar i don't know just shaggy pillows so these are shaggy but it's a different kind of shag and um i thought they would be a better fit than just having fluff 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 because i had four creamy shaggy pillows about mm, about that much fur hanging off so I thought that would be a great change for me by changing that. I also was looking for a basket, you guys. This basket to me is for, um, this basket is for housing all of my throw blankets. I um, bought two full-size blankets for my den because honey, throw blankets just will not work for us because when we are lounging downstairs, we want to cover our whole body from shoulder to toe and then wrap the covers underneath us. So I bought two blankets that matched our color scheme downstairs, which is the burgundy red, the dark red, and the, um, the mustard color. And then I bought my daughter a throw, and all the throws came from Home Goods. Um, none of them was over $12 and they're pretty plain and you'll probably see them when I do the video for this but um, I also bought a white one for my living room and I'll show you that um, video because I already pre-filmed it and um, I, know I didn't really like the video but I got this for $22 and now you know I said it has handles which makes it even nice and what I really love is this wooden top piece. So not only do you have a basket for your blankets, but you also have a tabletop to sit stuff on. For instance, if you wanted to sit something on it, you have something to do that with. And the bonus piece is that the table lifts up. It lifts up. So I know I'm not giving you good decoration, I mean good different spacing, but this was $22 and you guys know that I've been looking for a basket because when I went did my Joann's video, I was talking about I wanted something for my blankets in my den and this is for it. Now this was made in India and it was handcrafted in India and And just it says it's inspired by rich traditions. Okay, the last two items are super huge. Um, I got, and I've already filmed it, so I'm gonna just insert the footage for that. But I got an acrylic table from Ballard Designs. Now this table is $799, but trust me, your girl did not pay that. But it's a nice, a nice, I, it's nice knowing that's the value of it. 
and it is super 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 heavy you cannot lift it with one arm it does take two people to lift this table and it's just acrylic i'm like why is it so heavy but i absolutely love it i'm gonna insert some footages right here for you And last but not least, I'm going to insert footage on the massive rug that I purchased. Now, I purchased this rug from um, Home Goods as well, and this rug was, I think, $300, you know, $299.99 plus tax. And um, so I think that was right about $316. $316. This rug is about this thick in fur and it's it's getting ready to make me change my living room. For instance, my carpet, nothing's wrong with my carpet. It's just an off-white, tannish color, bone-like color um, carpet. And it's always worked, but it's flat, it's outdated. And so I've always wanted this rug and so when I was in home goods I was like went straight to rugs looking at rugs and I fell in love with it immediately to the touch and when I put it on my floor in my living room walking on it like several everybody that walked on it made me laugh and smile because they were like oh my god and trust me honey nobody's allowed with shoes on this rug because it is like a creamy white and it's a mixture of different fibers and strings kind of like that pillow so it's really got a lot of different textures to it even my cat is not allowed on this rug it is super super thick super super shaggy and what it's going to do because i laid it on top of the old rug i'm kind of like feeling like it looks like I'm trying to hide something, like maybe there's a stain on the rug, but no, I'm not trying to hide anything. I just love the rug and love how it looks with my furniture and decor. And I also, um, I think, you know, eventually down the line, maybe six or seven months from now, it may force me to finish the rest of the living room and make it hard, all hardwood and floor. So, Maybe that's what it might do, and I don't mind doing that. Um, anyway, you guys, this will conclude my haul, and then I'm going to say bye for now. I love you so much, and thanks for rocking with me even when I am slow poking about putting out videos. I really do appreciate it, and I'm trying to do better with putting out footage, and I'm going to work on that. Can't promise you nothing just yet, but I'm definitely going to work on getting some videos out and my goal is at least three a week um, and I'm hoping I can do that so anywho I love you guys so much and thanks for rocking with me bye